How's it going everybody? It's Gorilla Man here back with another car mechanic simulator video in today's video guys We are going to be working on the Bugatti right here in front of us the Bugatti Chiron uh, I think I said that right, but yeah, that's the one that we're doing today. This is the W12 motor. I think Double check double check V12 V12. I think it's supposed to be a W12, but it's a V12 um, But either way Still works. Uh, this is one that we're doing today uh, if you guys saw the last video, we went around to a bunch of auctions. We went around to the junkyard a few times. We picked up the Bugatti out of the junkyard. And we picked up the 2018 Durango Off-Road Edition, which you can tell by uh, the Ram in the front and our spaced wheels. Let me see. Yep, see right there, the spaced wheels, the offset and everything, uh, and the fenders. And then we also got a Bentley Continental, which is a super expensive a luxury car. I uh, got this one from auction also. Uh, this one's in really good shape right now though all we gotta do is a little bit of tlc and it'll be ready to go it's mainly just suspension and engine uh but today guys like i said working on the bugatti this one is going to be uh a full restoration like top to bottom you name it we're doing it that is what is going to be happening on this bad boy here let me get over to our main lifter all right so um i'm gonna start out and make it look nice we're gonna start with the body uh, body tires we'll do all that in this video and then we'll do suspension engine and everything in the next video um, just because that's the way I like doing these luxury cars I like making them look really really nice and then working on an engine to put into them to complement the uh, the look of the car so let's see what we got here for body pieces all right so we got a couple parts huge huge front window no side skirts this thing honestly is missing almost everything it really needs. Wow, yeah. So it's like uh, 1%. Yep, it's at 1%. All right. So you get the engine cover, clamshell, trunk, and then the front end. All right, we'll slap these ones back on. Save us a little cash. So there's the front end. We can slap on our trunk, engine cover, clamshell. All right. So we'll start from the rear to the front. Uh, we'll start with the bumper and tail lights. So Bugatti. Whoa, these are steering wheels for the thing. That's pretty cool. All right. So rear to front, we're gonna go tail light B. Then we'll go with a darker tail light or uh, bumper here, not tail light. There we go. So that looks good. Oh, really quick. Let me get the let me get the welder over here. Honestly, I think this whole thing would be the whole car. I'm pretty sure in real life is carbon fiber, so this would not be applicable at all. We would not be trying to weld things. We'd be doing like just whole whole new body pieces on there. Pretty much, I'm pretty sure would be what what would be going on right now. So let's see. I think that cleaned up. Yep, that cleaned up the body, and that cleaned up the interior. All right, that looks pretty good. I wonder how. Pretty realistic, actually. All right, well, there we go. So we got the rear. I feel like, I guess those are just huge vents. Uh, we'll start with the right side now. Uh, for mirrors, we'll do the darker mirrors. We'll do the lighter headlights here. Um, front hood. Uh, we'll do door B. I don't know why, just because all the windows check 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 and we'll do bumper B since we did uh, rear bumper B all right there we go no a pillars on this one which is really nice for me because I always forget those let me get that window out of there we don't want the, uh, the bad window in there so that bumper is more of like a front diffuser than it is a bumper which is good to know And I never even really did check prices on these, but it wasn't too bad actually. Seven fifty, a thousand. I mean, eh, somewhere around that range. That's really not too bad, considering the fact that the Lamborghini is so much more expensive. Um, in real life, though, this thing is like this is like a million dollar car. So, yeah, uh, we're already at we're already at a million dollars. Look at that. We slapped on the body pieces, and this thing is already over a million dollars, guys. Wow, that's pretty crazy, actually. 
Uh, needless to say, guys, this is probably going to be my new money car, quote, quote, as you guys catch what I'm saying. Um, we can get the Lamborghini, I think, up to around 2.4 million. And I think this, when it's all said and done, is going to be far, far past that. Front door, left window. Oh, can't, oh, wait, wait, wait. Bam. There we go. All right, so body condition. Uh, let's uh, let's get some plates on this. So I think it said it only takes one plate. And what do we want to do? What do we want to do? You know what? We'll throw on a New York plate. Why not? Might as well. And I guess it's in the crouch. Put the plate on. Got a couple of Cali plates. And did that do it for us? 96%. What are we missing here? Front clamshell, 23. I think I know what this means. Let's scooch this guy to... Oh, not to the lifter. I'll show you guys what this means in a second. So the front clamshell is kind of like a way for modders to put in extra interior and exterior things. So like right here, for instance, it's that. It's the wheel. So if I go into here, let me find that wheel. Uh, we're going to go with the black one because I think we're going to be painting this a darker gray. And you add in that and then see, bam, 100. All right, we're at 100 and or 100. We are at one, $1,070,475 so far. Uh, next, we're going to get this thing painted, and then we're going to roll back over here, and we're going to get wheels. So we're going to stick with these wheels, because I, I do like these. I do really like these wheels. Uh, we're going to try and repair them, too. So I'm not sure how well that's going to work. Hopefully, it'll work pretty well, but because um, I'm not sure if this has any... It's like when you buy uh, the wheels, it gives you an ET, which is like an offset from the base of the hub. And I think these have it, and I hate having to go through and have to do that. So I'm going to try not to have to do that. Wow. Factory color on this guys lime green what You tell me this thing was lime green at one point All right, let's change the view on this see what we got here. So any liveries. Oh, oh, yeah, of course. There's liveries on Bugatti All right, all right. I Do really like this one The It just it's perfect uh, Let me see what colors so we got the matte pearl Chameleon, the chrome is insane. Yeah, I think we're gonna do metallic, and I think we'll do. Should we do a color like an actual color? Oh, ooh, oh, look at that. That's like a. Uh, like a blood maroon. Oh, that is nice. Wow, that one that was just a random slider I put on. That came out really, really good. All right, let's get that back. All right, let's get these tires and wheels popped apart, taken off, and let's work on them. So I think this is like a negative offset here, actually. Because you can see the hub through these wheels, I think. Can you? No, that was just me. Okay. I was gonna say, I was like, wait a second. And then since this is going to be a V12, I, uh, I'll stick with race tires for now because that's what it came with. But ideally, when we hit the hit the drag strip, I will probably be on slicks. I think, um, just because obviously slicks are gonna be a little bit quicker. All right, let's get all these separated. We'll have to uh, sandblast these down and get them fixed. Let me see if I can even fix these. Okay, I can. All right, now I want to see if these rims are dark or not. Okay, I don't want to. I don't want to set it. All right. Well, while I wait for that, so this is a 23A. So 265, 35, 20. 265, 35, 20. 265, 35. Okay, so there's those two. 
Now we gotta get the other ones. Which is not that one. Alright, let's go find that used tire. 365, 30, 21. Okay. 365. 365. Come on, let's go to that one. 30, 21. Alright, we need two of those. Those are some thick tires. Those are the rears. Those are, uh... Those are some big boys. All right, so you need a set of 21s with no offset. Oops, go up here. Uh, right here. 21, no offset, because we didn't, we weren't able to salvage the other one. All right, here's our 21s. Yeah, I do really like this tire. So it's like a it's like a brushed aluminum silver on the outside and then it has uh in between like all the cracks and crevices there is a black finish on it, which I really 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 like. This is one of the few DLC rims I really 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 like. All right, install. There we go. Take, balance. All right. We just got to wait to balance these now. All right. We got all four ready to go. Keep in mind, guys, I am just putting these up here to mount for now. These are not, these are obviously not going to stay here because I have to remove them to fix the uh, hubs and all the suspension parts. So these are just a temporary hold just so I can lower the car down and get a good look at it. All right, there we go. All right, how do these look? Oh, those look pretty clean. Oh, wow, these are super, super nice rims. Oh, I love the look so far. It looks it looks really good actually. I'm really That looks incredible. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below. Do you guys like this? Oh, I do. I really 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 like this. The color is amazing. The rims are actually really really good. I a lot of those DLC rims I wasn't too big of a fan of. It is nice to have the options though, but I really really like these a lot. Wow, I can't get over these rims. I'm going to start using these rims on pretty much everything now. But there we go, guys. All right, yeah, we got to got to get over that. There we go. Um, we're finishing this off at $1.23 million. Uh, one, oh, so it's, it's $1,238,400. That's what we're ending this video on. Next video, um, we're going to be getting all of the suspension, engine, um, all the tuning done. We're going to be running this thing. It'll be a, probably like a 40-minute 40, 40 long video on the next one. Uh, we're going to be running this thing uh, into the ground pretty much to see how fast it can get. Uh, it is a Bugatti, so I just can't really check that. But these these things are incredibly fast, like 0 to 60 in like 2 seconds or something like that. Uh, maybe 1.6. I can't remember if that was that or the Tesla. Uh, but there we go. If you guys liked this car and you guys are excited, uh, leave a like down below. And if you guys aren't subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button. I think we're just about to hit 90k subs on the channel. Uh, which then is just one little final stretch here to 100k and then we are set because i am so so excited uh so if you guys haven't subscribed yet please subscribe i'd greatly appreciate it and hopefully i'll see all you guys in the next car mechanic simulator video